What is up, Ashes and Angels, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, I am doing, as you can tell by the title, what I got for my 21st birthday haul slash just what I got for my 21st birthday. Um, my birthday was July 7th, and I turned the big 21, so I am legal legal now. So, I'm legal to buy a drink if I want to, which more than likely I probably will. So, I wanted to share with you guys everything that I got for my 21st birthday. Now, I do get money, um, like cash gifts, so I will be sharing what I purchased with the cash gifts that I was given. So, I'm going to start with what my mom and dad got me. So, my dad got me, he just gave me $100, but then he was also in on one of my big gifts. But, my mom tried to get me 21 gifts for my 21st birthday. And it's in this cute confetti bag that says happy birthday. It's huge. The camera doesn't do it justice. And I'm going to show you guys everything that was in the bag. So, I don't remember what order I pulled them out just because it's been almost a week. So, I'm just going to go with what I have. So, first off, I got a card like I always do. 21 years old. And it's cheetah because I love cheetah print. And my mom gave me $21. Then she got me, these are like my favorite face masks. These were marked down, which is what I always get is the marked down ones because they're just cheaper and more affordable. So she got me all of the Yes 2s, which I love the Yes 2 products. So she got me a calming mud mask for sensitive skin because my skin is super sensitive. She also got me a avocado fragrant free hydrating cream mask. And then the last one is a vitamin C um, boosting mud mask, which is awesome for your skin. Next, she got me a bath bomb, and this is a disco bomb, and it's from the brand De Balm Bath. And it's two sisters who make these bath bombs this one is pretty big and with each bath bomb you get a surprise inside so it's supposed to have a light up surprise inside so whenever I use this I will have to see what my light up surprise is so yeah and it smells amazing it smells like fruit punch and I love it and I can't wait to use it next thing she knows me so well I love this gum extra peppermint I always chew this gum. I take it with me to class when I am on my college campus during classes. I keep it in my purse. I take it practically everywhere with me. Next, she got me my favorite mints. These are Tic Tac Orange. I could eat these like they're candy and sometimes I honestly have. So, she got me my favorite Tic Tacs. Then, this is kind of like an inside joke because my leg hair grows back so fast like I can shave that night and the next morning my leg hair is back it's not super long but I always mentioned that I wanted to try Nair so she got me Nair and I did try it it worked really well and I'm really satisfied with it and this I guess new formula or whatever that they have doesn't smell like chemically it smells actually good now this one that she got me has aloe and lanolin. I'm sorry if I mispronounced that, but yeah. And then it's just a refreshing scent, and I kid you not, it is. It smells so good. So yes, I will definitely be using that product. Next, she got me my favorite candy, which are these Snicker Minis, because I love Snickers. And I've eaten a few, but not a whole lot, because I knew I was wanting to do this video there's a notification that I'm gonna swipe off okay and then she got me this is actually from a women's expo that she went to with a friend she knows that I love the teardrop style um earrings and so she got me three pair and I love them so the first pair she got me is zebra which is so stinking cute. She said they didn't have any cheetah with them there, but they do have it at uh, their shop, which is actually a local shop where I live. So I might get cheetah, but I'm fine with zebra too. I like zebra print and it's like a faux leather. They're really cute. 
Then this is a faux leather one also, and it is, let's see how they, they describe this as peach, but I describe it as like a mauve and a light pink, but it is faux leather. They are super cute. I might actually wear them today with my top because it kind of matches the pink on my top. So that's, and then she also got me this pair, which is, I like to say like a mint type but it is marble design and this was actually from being in the display window so long but it's fine with me i think it just adds character so there is the front of them and then there is the back they are super cute and the company name if you guys want to know or order from them is hot gems texas is their store name but then also on their card it was called hot is ice and this is how they spell hot h-a-u-t-e so she got me three pairs of earrings and i love them now for my big gift i have been begging for months for a new ipad because my old one i got back in 2015 or 2016 i can't really remember um and it was one of the old iPad Airs. It wouldn't update to the newest update because it told me I had to be have it plugged into an iMac or a MacBook, which I don't have. Or I could take it to an Apple store, which I also don't have where I live. So I begged and begged and begged for an iPad because I need it for school because I want to take notes on it. So in the bag, I, this was actually the last gift that I did open. And... I kind of felt it first and I was like, okay, I think I know who this is. And it was. So this is the Apple Pencil second generation. And then she had a sticky note on it. And when I say she, I meant my mom. She had a sticky note on this that said the other part of this is coming Monday. Which it actually came the day of, let's see, July 8th. So the day after my birthday. And then... I received on July 8th the iPad Pro 11 inch third generation and it is in I want to say yeah it's in silver and then she also got it monogrammed on the back so it won't like I guess if it were ever to get lost which it won't because I keep my eyes on it like a hawk um, it has my monogram on it. So I got the iPad Pro 11, which is my most expensive, but my most favorite gift. So continuing on with that, that was everything in the bag. Now I'm going to move on to gifts that I was given from my friends. And then I will also move on to what I bought with cash gifts that I received. Whew, do not yell. Okay, so... From my grandparents, they gave me $50, so I've been wanting a new pair of Kinder Scott earrings for the longest time. I really love the L Gold Drop earrings in like any color. I had a maroon pair, or I have a maroon pair, and I wanted a black pair just because it goes with everything. So with that money, these were actually on sale for 4th of July. So, I ordered them, and this is the L Gold Drop Earring in Opaque Glass. I love it. It is so pretty. I've worn these twice, and I just love how they look on me. And, yeah. So, I got Kinder Scott's. Then, from a good family friend, they got me this little angel bear, which I've decided will represent, um my dachshund that I lost in April of last year, Peanut. So this is my little angel bear that I have officially named Peanut. And then she got me super cute, and I can't wait to hang it up, decorative metal wall hook. And it looks like a hanger. And then it has these little rhinestones on it, which I love. And then all these hooks for jewelry. And on the back, it just shows, like, necklaces, and then you can hook bracelets to it, and all that fun stuff. So, they got me that, which I love. Why do I always yawn in my videos? <laughs> so, moving on. 
with the next cash gift. So, uh, like I said, my dad did give me $100 in cash. And so, while I had my niece down here with me to help celebrate, we went shopping. And the first thing we purchased were matching Starbucks cups because I've never actually had a legit Starbucks cup like tumbler. So, we got this one that has Cheetah on it. It's super cute. I actually had to label mine because we didn't want to get them mixed up. But it's super cute. This is a 24 ounce tumbler so it will not actually fit a Trenta from Starbucks. Because I did order a Trenta and I had some left. However, it will fill a venti um, pink drink. Because my niece got that and it literally filled it to the top. So, it will fit a venti. And then next, while we were at Target... I needed a iPad case because I did not want my iPad to get damaged or broken. So it's a super basic case. It's black and then this is the spec symbol. This is a spec case. It locks in place to where like you, well obviously not right there, but it does lock into place. There we go. Not have it locked to where it will not come open. So it's locked and then on the back here if you want to use the camera all you do is flip this down and it magnetizes and then it magnetizes back up. It can hold the Apple Pencil which I have on it. Um, I have my Apple Pencil right here charging and then another cool thing about this case is I actually had this on my old iPad um, from a different brand but it has these little notches here. So that way you can prop up your iPad for however you need it. So I got that with some money because I needed a new case because with every new Apple product, they always change the cameras. So you have to buy a new case. <laughs> Moving on. Oh my Lord, if I don't quit yawning. <laughs> Moving on, next I got a, these are by Impress, and they're just press-on nails. My niece also got some too. I like short, she likes medium or long. So I picked out this marble set, which also came with glitter, but in my experience with glitter, oh hi Marley. <laughs> with my experience with the glitter ones, they just don't stay on as long, and there she goes. And I didn't, I just wanted to do the basic, like, light gray with marble. And the name of the set by Impress is Knockout if you want to go get these. And they were on sale as well. I'm trying to figure out what else I bought. Oh, then we went to the mall because we had to go pick up my cookie cake. And we went to Route 21. And we got super cute matching tube tops and this is just a tie-dye one and we got matching tie-dye and then i also got a cheetah one but i worn it and it's dirty so it's in the it's in my basket to be washed so i cannot show that but it is super cute they were on clearance which is awesome the tie-dye ones feel awesome but the other two that we got she got just a plain black one because they didn't have another cheetah and those two were like the softest material, but these were on sale for $5.97, so they weren't even that much. And I'm wearing a jacket over it just because it looks good. <laughs> and I wish I could show the cheetah one, but I don't have it. So then, with the rest of my money, what I plan to do with that is I plan to get the high top black converse because I have a high top white converse but I also want the high top black converse so I'm going to order them because they are actually on sale otherwise I would go get them in the store because I do have a journeys where I can get it but I'm going to order that and then I'm also going to put some money towards this year's school supplies because I need more for college because you literally use a whole notebook filled with every single page filled with notes so yeah i gotta get more notebooks more pens more highlighters all that fun stuff i actually love school supply shopping and i might do a school supply um haul for this year for college i don't really know 
if I will. I mean, I'll see how much I have, and if I have enough, I will do it. If not, I might still do it, honestly, I don't know. So that is everything that I got. For my 21st birthday, I also wanted barbecue, so we did get barbecue, and then we made my favorite jalapeno ranch dip. So, yeah, that's everything, I think, that I got, and I love everything. I'm grateful for everything, especially my new iPad, because I know they are not cheap, and I love everything that I got. Can't wait to use it all, and hang up my new necklace um, and bracelet holder. So, with that being said, I love you guys so much. I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. I'm sorry if the lighting sucked today. It is a rainy, rainy day, so I had to turn on my LEDs. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. And we love you all so much, and we will see you in our next video. Bye!